Let's turn off that attract mode. Okay, I think everything's working. I got a little scared for a minute because I thought it was frozen on the title screen, but it seems to be loading everything. Okay, it's fine. Hello. I don't know how many people <laughs> are going to show up for this because, uh, well, you know, it's what it's. But I really wanted to play this game and I don't need, I don't need an excuse. <laughs> but I just thought it would be fun to not watch the demo mode, uh, to stream it, share it with friends. I think they're gonna wait A minute to see if anybody shows up in the chat. Uh, it just <laughs> let the most annoying title screen in history play. This music and these poppin' ass sound effects drove me absolutely insane while I was <sighs> test running this. And then every... it just keeps loading. It's 
spoilers. I could just navigate off of the title screen, but everybody needs to see this. Check my audio real quick. Oh, oh God, no, no. The ghosts will just get cracking. Because I'm honestly getting sick of this looping. We will return to the adventures of Thunderbolt in, in space. space after these words from our sponsor. Not another commercial. What game sound is loud enough? Hey, Oddball, let's go dig for pirate treasure in the yard. You bet. But Domino, do you think it will be okay with Mom? Yeah, no sweat. Mom and Dad will be back from their walk soon. What could possibly go wrong? Hey, Domino, what's this? That's just one of those crummy robot toys Corella de Ville is making. Who would want such an ugly <laughs> hunk of junk? I'm ruined. Ruined, I say. My toys, my marvelous, splendid toys. They're selling worse than Brussels sprouts. Don't worry, Miss Deville. I'm sure this new one will be a big hit. No fool. Can't you see? The spoiled brats of England must be spending their pocket money on something else. And we must eliminate that competition. Yes, there's no other choice. Professor Fosboom, get your head out of your toy programming and answer the phone. Uh, yes, Cruella, my sweet. Fosboom, my high-tech hireling, initiate plan B. Hey everybody, we're back! Mom? Dad? Hey, where is everybody? Oh, look, Dipstick. There are Oddball and Domino. <laughs> Why is his name Dipstick? Listen, it's coming on the TV right now. And all over England, pets of every kind are vanishing without a trace. Scotland Yard is now on the case and... <gasps> I just can't believe it! Our puppies! Gone! It's that horrid Cruella de Vil up to her old tricks. I just know it. But what can we do, darling? I'll tell you what we can do. We'll go over to that evil woman's toy factory, get our pups back, and have it out with her once and for all. You're right, Dipstick. Oh, I could just bite that woman. Now, Oddball and Domino, you puppies stay right here. Take care of our humans while we're gone, and don't worry. We'll be back with all your brothers and sisters as soon as we can. Goodbye, my darlings. And be good. <coughs> cool. So, do you want to stay here and be good? Or do you want to go help rescue our family? My thoughts exactly, sis. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> so this premise is kind of a lot. Um... So I don't really remember this movie, but I don't think it was anything like this. <laughs> this is like a very, very loose adaptation, if anything. Hello there, puppy. Name's Waddlesworth. Welcome to Regent's Park. Hi, Waddlesworth. I'm looking for my brothers and sisters. I think they might be in trouble. 
Yes, Cruella de Vil has sent out an army of robotic toys to capture all the pets in England. <laughs> Why? What is she going to do with them? The robots are locking the pets into crates like this one and taking them to Cruella's toy factory outside of London. Can we stop them? Of course! The toys are dangerous if you're not careful, but they are very poorly made. A loud bark at close range will destroy their cheap electronics. What about my brothers and sisters trapped in the crates? Try tumbling oh into God. the crates. You should be able to smash them open and rescue the puppies inside. Thanks, Waddlesworth. I'll see you soon. Okay. So, <laughs> that was a real fly-by explanation of the mechanics. Um, Hello. basically, destroy all the toys. Smash open the crates and rescue the puppy. Okay, I should talk to this fucking squirrel. Oh, hi there. My name's Fidget. <laughs> My mom calls me that because, well, I never stop moving. <laughs> nice to meet you, Fidget. There's a lot of fun stuff to do around here, but, but look out for those evil toys. If you have any questions, you just come find me, and I'll tell you what I know. Bye now. Okay. God, okay, so I played this game a lot as a kid. Um, I remember I had like a couple of friends, me and my sister had these two friends who were also sisters, um, and they had this game and, and they would bring it over to our house and so we would just play it here. Like, uh, But it wasn't until like, I don't know, it was like years later that we actually got it ourselves. <laughs> Um, we were like obsessed with this, like, I don't know, I think it's a, I don't really need that. The, 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 like, food items are health, and I haven't taken any damage yet, I don't think, so. Um, yeah, I don't know, I think this game is, <laughs> like, I've played it, like, to varying degrees, like, a few times, like, since my my youth and like I think that all holds up okay. It's still like fun to play. Ah, thanks for rescuing me. Yeah. Great voices on the puppies. Um Okay. So we also have bones. Which you can also sniff to like dig up. And I don't remember what you get for collecting all the bones. Probably a sticker? Because I think. I, I don't know. Like, I don't know that I'm gonna 100% this game. <laughs> but you can collect stickers, and that. I think. I don't know. Does that unlock mini games or something? I'm not, <laughs> I'm not sure. Okay. These cars. That was bullshit. <laughs> this is what I was about to say. These cars are the worst enemies, and that's why it's like impossible to kill them without getting hurt. But luckily, there's a stake nearby. <sighs> the thing about this game. Oh my god. No, no. 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 Die. Okay. I think it'd be, like the sound of those cars laughing triggers such anxiety. Um, the thing about this game is that like you can pretty much finish all the levels, like with a few exceptions, without like actually completing them. Like in this level, for example, there's like you know there's some stuff to do. Like obviously you have to collect the puppies, and there's uh, one of the gorilla's henchmen is here, and you can deal with him, but technically you don't have to do any of that, you can just run to the end of the level and progress. Um, which, I, I, I guess, you will leave all your brothers and sisters behind. Let's talk to the squirrel again. Cruella's henchman Jasper yet. When you do, bring him back to my tree. 
I bet we could play a funny trick on him. <laughs> See you later. Oh my god. Uh huh. Yeah, funny trick. What if he's allergic to bees? Sociopath. Okay. Well, let's go find Jasper, I guess. Oh wait, there's uh. I'll do that in a sec. The, oh, the like henchmen in this game actually really scared me. A lot of this game really scared me as a kid. There's some pretty spooky levels towards the end. All right. Oh, also you can uh, you can switch between puppies. There's no mechanical difference. It's just purely an aesthetic choice. But like presumably this is for girls and this is for boys. I'll do Domino for now. Uh, okay, so there's a secret here. Let me go chase a pigeon. Oh my god, this is gonna be really annoying. Come on. No, don't run over there. That's where Jasper is. Don't look. Don't. Don't look over here. I'm... Oh no, he sees me. Oh shit. Oh god. I'm really scared. Jasper's gonna appear behind me and attack me. Maybe that. Oh no, he's coming. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. I mean, I need to take him to the bees. Oh, okay, I guess he... They have a pretty... What, like a... Oh my god. A long range for detection. Okay, I'm just gonna take him to the bees. I don't wanna prolong this. <laughs> no! I say they have a long range, but also it's very easy to lose them. Come on. Come back here, you mutt. Okay, Fidget. Now what? You gotta make him dizzy. What does he bad in coming up? Now I got ya. Oh, look out for his neck. This <laughs> wicked squirrel. That should do it. <sighs> All right, you. <sighs> Just a real still like. <sighs> and now for the coup de grosse. The conditions for this prank to work uh, have to be pretty specific. <laughs> oh my god, he doesn't even know if he's allergic. This is fucked up. He could have killed that man. Point. In the end. <laughs> yeah, so funny. Oh, I got a sticker. Great. For killing a man. Do you have anything to say to me, Fidget? <laughs> yeah, so funny. That was the funniest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> I hope he's not allergic. Hey, now that Jasper's taken care of, do you suppose you could do me a favor? Huh? Sure. What's that? Oh, I lost my favorite nut. I go searching for it, but my mom doesn't let me go very far. Why is your tree. mouth moving? If you find it, would you please bring it back to me? You bet, Fidget. Telepathic squirrel. Well, yeah, I'll get your nut for you. Okay, how many bones do I have? I have 50 bones. Okay. Maybe I'll get all the bones on this level, but not all of them. I should really sniff for some up here. Okay, it's just gonna take me down here. Ugh, the camera in this is making me... Okay... No! No! God damn it! Oh, oh no! Now I really want those bones. Oh! Yeah. 
Okay, I got it. Puppies is that? Four. Oh, I know, I know what the other two are. Okay. Rolling is OP, honestly. Where? This, like, scent trail thing is not very reliable. Oh no, there's cars. Uh oh, hi, Tom. Damn it, that's not fair! <laughs> you can lay on the floor. The cat is... Well, he's not watching me play. He's certainly in the room while I play. So easy to miss these blondes. Okay. <gasps> no! <laughs> I hate these cars so much. Okay. There's the net. So yeah, this this is the the end goal of the level. And so I could feasibly oh sticker. Uh, so I could feasibly leave like without getting fidget or not, or without rescuing this puppy or any of the puppies or doing any of the level. You guys run straight through to the end. Great game design. Okay, that's all the puppies. I think I got all the stickers so far, except for probably get one for the nut. Got your nut. Is this the nut you were looking for, Fidget? Yeah, that's it. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Here's a little reward. You're cool. Uh, whoa. I don't know how that nut is different than any other nut, but I'm glad that you like it and gave me bones for it. Okay. Oh, five more bones. Oh, I should eat that. Doesn't matter. I think I get my health back at the next level, but. God, this nose is so unreliable. <laughs> Pick it up. Goose chase for these bones. One more. Got the music in this game. I I like the music in this game. I think it has a pretty good soundtrack, but it all tends to get kind of annoying after a while. <laughs> oh. I have... What? Where are you taking me? Oh, okay. Okay, it's fine. Everybody calm down. Alright, I think that's 100% of this level. save over my test file. Wow, we have the exact same percentage. <laughs> Which is sad because I was uh, made it to level three in my test run. <clears throat> Hi kitty cat, what are you doing here? Ahem, I am Sergeant Tibbs, and I've been sent to help you save your brothers and sisters. 
and track down Cruella de Vil. What do you know about Cruella? Well, let's is this a character? Is this a canonical character? <laughs> is Finch the canonical character? I have no idea. Any help you can give me, Mr. Tibbs. We'll see you soon. Oh, okay. Yeah, so now we're at Toy Store for some reason. I have no clue how or why we ended up here after Regent's Park. But whatever. So, so that, those were some secret bones there. I think you might notice I'm a real pro at this game. Those things are very annoying. They take more than one hit to kill. Toys have to be so <laughs> demented looking. Okay, there's like straight up an explosive enemy up there. Oh god, oh god, I can hear it. No! There are a lot of enemies that scare me in this game. The camera, the camera leaves a lot to be desired, but it's a PS1 game, so it doesn't have 3D camera control. Or just any level of control or finesse. Oh my god. Getting Twitter notifications. Whoop, whoop. <sighs> Hello, Jazz. You're here. <laughs> Let me know. Um, get back up in this room. I don't think. Surely there are no bones buried in this tiled floor. Oh, you again. So tits. Are you so tits? I'll buy Cruella's place. Yes, I'm quite familiar with the area nearby her filthy, decrepit mansion. Her mansion? Is that near her toy factory? How do I get there? Let's take it one step at a time. You'll need to get through this toy store and up to the top of Big Ben via Piccadilly Circus. Why? The top of Big Ben? But why? <laughs> yeah, that's From what I'm saying. Big Ben's bell tower, you can contact the barking chain at twilight. Those dogs should be able to help you get out of London and make your way through the countryside to Cruella's mansion. Wow, thanks, Tibbs. Oh, wow. Oh, you know what? I might... Oh my god, I didn't wasn't seeing your chat messages this whole time because I had top chat on instead of <sighs> live chat. I'm sorry. <laughs> yes, Frankie Muniz does play Domino. <laughs> The, yeah, a real, real uh, big get for 102 Dalmatians puppies for the rescue. But yeah, I don't remember this movie either. I think I've seen it like uh, uh, once. I think I've probably seen it once, like when I was a kid. And I honestly don't remember liking it very much. But I really like this game <laughs> because it's nothing like the movie, frankly. Um, I don't know if you caught any of the story at the beginning, but. Basically, um, all of Domino. Okay, so Domino and Aud what's her name? Oddball. Actually, I'll, I'll be Oddball for this little. Domino and Oddball were like out playing in the backyard, <laughs> and while they were in the backyard, all of their siblings who were in the house got kidnapped. Their parents are still there. It's fine. Um, and I guess Cruella Deville is like kidnapping all of the the um, pets in London because somehow they're like the competition of pets is ruining her toy business I, I don't know so I have to go rescue all the puppies because we don't trust our parents to do it I guess also let me know how the audio is um, run up next to them and press the game the versus my voice. I tried to balance it as best I could, but I don't know. I feel like I'm just toys. still too quiet. Target should be clearly visible. 
Shoot all of them, and you will receive a bonus. Okay. A shooting minigame. Oh my god, this feels terrible. <laughs> You know, this is fucked up, like, Tibbs knew that my sibling was trapped up there and, like, you are a super puppy. Let, <laughs> he's not really helping, he's just, like, telling me where they are. It's kind of like a weird saw trap. Oh, I already got the ball on the slide, it's good. Wait, is there a door down here? Okay, that's good. Oh, one sec, I need to take a pause. ERB. Okay, I'm back. Had to feed the cat. Oh my god, I remember poochies. Yeah. Oh, let, let me be clear. Um, the plot that was that's the plot of the game. I had, I don't think it has 
any resemblance to the plot of the movie, <laughs> which I could not, like, I couldn't tell you what the plot of the movie was. Okay, let's see. Um, but I, yeah, I don't think the movie had anything to do with, like, fighting evil toys. Well, well, who knows? Okay, uh... I'm a little lost. So, like, immediately after that real, uh, slow ball of a level, first level, this level's non-linear. <laughs> okay, I don't know why that puppy sounds like a chain smoker, but... Okay. No! Yeah, like I said, I've played, or I, I watched that movie once, I played this game a ton, which is why I'm such a pro at it now. Uh, okay. But what now? I'm gonna train. Can I get up there from here? Probably not. No. Okay. I think I have to go... Door I came out of, or is the other one? I'm already lost. Wait. Okay, that's that's that one. That's this door. challenge. Um, alright. I guess I'm gonna eat this burger. Yeah, I... Again, it has... I, I don't think any of these settings are in the movie. <laughs> um, so I'm not, like... I really would love to know what the, like, the, the um... I don't know, the, like, design document looked like for this game. There's a, a real variety of settings which I like, um, like they kind of take you all throughout places in London, um, because this game does take place in London despite the fact that both of the puppies have an American accent, um, and, and also all their siblings have American accents, um, but it's all just... Like, this is not like any toy store I've ever seen. Also, like, I'm just like kind of releasing these puppies, and I don't know how they're finding their way home. But, <laughs> it seems kind of irresponsible. Wait, did I talk to this guy? I just ignore him. I just ignored him. I like never watched any of the cutscenes or like talked to any of the animals when I played this game as a kid, and I think it's really showing right now. It is a scale model of an actual steam train, and you can ride it through the store if you want. That's so cool. <laughs> okay. That's so cool. Oh. Come on. Okay. It's a pro stress. I hope it didn't work. There we go. Oh my god, okay. Oh, okay, yes. Secret room. <laughs> no, don't go on the train! Yeah, there's a, like... I, I don't know. I would love to, like, again, I would really love to know the thought process behind how they made this game. Because, like, I mean, you know, it's like a 
a probably pretty low effort um, movie tie-in. I mean, it's certainly not big budget. <laughs> but they had to, they clearly put like some original thought to it though. Someone was really proud to work on this. I don't know why that puppy sounds like Nibbler from Futurama. Oh god, this is so annoying. <laughs> Is that all the bones? The camera is not at a helpful angle right now. There's nothing I can do. Okay, I think. I think that's all of them. It's nice that the train waits for me here. We get this life. And then train left. But I think this is the last stop on the train, so I don't think I need to get back on it. But it's just kind of fun to ride around on, but I also don't want to wait for it. Maybe if I just go into the next room, it'll be there again. Oh, damn it, no. <laughs> well, that doesn't just world revolve around me. Wait. Was that the train? Did it just rush past me? Man, fuck that. <laughs> okay. DeVille is released from prison, however, when she discovers that her parole officer's boyfriend owns an animal shelter that has fallen on hard time, she pretends she wants to help on her to get to the dog. I don't remember that at all. Who's her boyfriend? Oh, her parole officer's boyfriend. Okay, not her. I was like, Corolla got game? I know that that, like, the pelt guy is in it. That, like, French guy with, like, the leopard coat. Yes. Let me on this train. <laughs> Well, we just blasted past it. This train is what I would call a crazy train. I'm very fast. There's no kind of. There's some railing, I guess, but there's not really a lot of safety. You know, this sucks actually because I can't, like. Oh, I can turn the camera! God damn it. the whole level, so that's kind of fun. Real glad I waited for that. Oh, I can move around on the train too? <laughs> Wait, no! Shit. Okay, yes, get me off the train. Wait, no, 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 I don't want to be in this room. Oh, God damn it. Oh. My speed run is... Suffering. Just let me out here. I'll just I'll just walk the rest of the way. I don't want to deal with this fucking train anymore. It does remind me of the um, Casey Jr. train at Disneyland, but like less charming. <laughs> That's like my favorite ride at Disneyland. Okay, I already went up there. I have five puppies. Just about done. Although I think there's some bones buried in this room. In order to reach the exit, you must take this elevator down to the basement warehouse. Oh, how do I do that? Just walk into the elevator and press your action button. That's down, Daisy. <laughs> okay, thanks for telling me that. It's weird. This game like doesn't tutorialize much, but they feel the need that they have to tell you how to ride the elevator. Oh my god, only 77 bones, where are they? Oh no, I am not getting on the train again. You know what? Fuck it. I'm not 100%ing this game. This 
spend enough time in this nightmare factory. Oh no, my worst enemy. Scary blowing up cars, okay. Um, okay, Wait, lots of burgers and stuff, and I don't really need them. I, well, I say that now, but I could very well get mangled by this. Oh. This scale in this game is interesting. It's like, well, actually, you'll see that on the next level. Like how like weirdly small this puppy is. Terrible place for a checkpoint. No. I just said I wasn't gonna try to get all the bones, but I really. Oh wait! Oh wait! No, that's not. That's not how you get that one. What a fool! Die! Get you. Ugh. Oh my god, the platforming in this game is so awful and it's only gonna get worse. Oh, sticker. There we go. Ooh. This is another level where you can just skip everything and just run straight to the end. Oh, okay, so there's not really a plot to this level, I guess. Uh, 96. Uh, I'm not gonna run and see this whole store just for four bones. I I don't know. <laughs> Just to be scary, I guess. Because it's Cruella's toy factory. I don't know. I hope he gets royalties for um, his likeness being used. Okay, I've had the music for this level stuck in my head for days. Okay, Fidget's here. Hi again, Fidget. Where are we? Oh, we're near Piccadilly Circus with lots of cars, trees, yeah, lots of cars. The Kingdom right Hearts way. level of NPCs. How are how are like how are these NPC like speaking of NPCs, how are these like animal guys getting around? Cause they they each show up in like multiple levels and they're like all ridiculous distances apart. I hate these fucking cars. Wait, Jasper isn't in this level. Horace is the one that's in this level. Maybe she can't tell them apart. Pup Inc. Wow, I love that band. Puppy Love. Oh wait, wait so here's an example <laughs> of kind of the weird scale. Like this... How big is this bus? Oh. Anyway, it's nice that they don't run me over. With the only one out here driving, I think. Uh, very watchful. Okay. What is that? Oh, that's the pivot. <laughs> wow, that pillar sure is high. I hear there's a secret way to get on top of it. I, I think you have to find four smaller statues nearby and turn them to lower this statue. I can't hear you, Fidget. The car is running by. Why is the camera like? Like, why are they so high up in the frame? Cool. I wasn't listening. I already know what to do. Uh, wait. 
going back here. <laughs> what, this isn't what Piccadilly Square looks like? Oh my god, that draw distance though. Oh my god, leave me alone. I'm just mindlessly driving back and forth. But I'm on a mission. Type of enemy in this game. Come here. Where'd you go? Die at bottom then. Ugh! Ugh! This gun sucks so much. I don't think I got them all. Okay. Spin this. Oh wait, let me switch to let's alternate between puppies. Every level. Ugh. Nope. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? I don't understand the like placement of the puppies. Like why are they just like in the middle of town <laughs> in a crate? Best part. Wow, what a great view. <laughs> Sticker for committing suicide. That's true. But like up to the the um Treasure Chest and Kingdom Hearts aren't a plot point. Like, the plot of this game is when I'm, like, collecting puppies. I just don't understand how they got scattered all throughout London. <laughs> hey. I mean, like, I, I shouldn't be, like, so critical of it, I guess. Like, I, I doubt they put much thought into the story of this game. I never questioned it as a kid, and I shouldn't now. It's weird how London is so polluted when there's literally nobody here except for that poor bus driver. Like if you think too hard about the world that this game takes place in, it's a little, <laughs> a little spooky, honestly. No people except for the evil dog catchers. It's just puppies and crates that are talking animals. Hey, Bridget, what are those things in the walls? It's some kind of puzzle Professor Farsboom set up here to test your intelligence. You have to pick the puzzles <laughs> in the right order. If you get one wrong, you have to start over. I mean, I'm pretty sure they, they started like with the premise of this game was like you have to find all the puppies and then they just kind of worked around a bit <laughs> which like you also have to find all the puppies in kingdom hearts because <laughs> these puppies just never stop getting lost <laughs> yeah the, the floating foods that you can eat to recover your health I think are hamburgers, hot dogs, steaks, and pizza. Like, so if you um, 
if you go back and replay the levels, like after you've already collected the puppies, um, then the, the puppy crates will be replaced with pizza crates. <laughs> so you can smash open, smash them open and get a slice of pizza instead of a brother or sister. Oh yeah, okay. There's Horus. And Fidget. Well, honestly, I would, I would rather interact with Horus than Fidget at this point. What? Do you see what I see? Look over there, next to Horus. You know, what is the camera angle? A manhole cover. <laughs> yeah, no, I saw it. This. Like, you know, we don't have to do, like, this guy's just do, like, I know he's a bad guy, but he's just doing his job. Like, I could just ignore him. I don't have to trap him in a manhole. Hello! Are you interested in a solid zirconium roof for your home? You should be! Let me tell you why! <laughs> I mean, that's an important plot point for you, certainly. Oh, I wasn't doing anything. I don't want to put him in this manhole, but I think I have to do it to get a sticker. Anyway, oh no. Oh god! I heard the clown and panicked. Um, leave me alone! Wait, can, he can't get me in here, can he? No, he's just running away. Um, I was going to say that Squall in Kingdom Hearts seems more concerned for the puppies than Sora does. <laughs> Okay, I guess I better uh, attempt to kill this man. Okay, it's open. Now for the fun part. Was there a Bluff City ad? I mean, I have to go to the sewer later, so maybe that wasn't a good call. Wait, was it the person on the phone? Because I super wasn't listening to them. Hello! Are you interested in a solid zirconium roof for your home? <laughs> you should be! Let me tell you why! Great. Oh, I think if I run up to the manhole thingy, I think he has a line of dialogue? Maybe not. Okay, that's what I thought you were talking about. <laughs> oh, I need to listen to more Bluff City. Okay, I just- I feel insane now because I swear playing this game as a kid used to be able to bark at the manhole cover and have him talk. I'm just gonna move on. Um, okay, just the way. God! How did that not kill it? Oh my god, fuck these cars so much. Okay, we have one more driver out in London today. I love the sound it makes when you hit enemies. <laughs> it's just like a like a kind of a fleshy thud. Very satisfying. I guess it also makes that sound when you hit anything. I wonder if there's any bones here. There it is. Okay, yeah, I know I have to get these. Excuse me. <laughs> I do enjoy barking in Okami. In this game, barking is an attack, so you can hurt toys with bark by barking. And I think there's other, like, 
well, as you saw with the manhole, there's things you can interact with by barking. Imagine the last thing you heard was this. It's like a little puppy barking, and then you died. Oh. No! 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 There's a hot dog up there! Wait, don't... Uh. What? <laughs> what even happened there? Oh my god, I'm not looking forward to the next level. Oh, but since I'm playing this on an emulator, I could use save states. I have to keep that in mind. Nice job! Thank you. Adult puppy. Okay. Uh, which way do I come from? That way, I think. Yes. All of the bones. I think more games should implement, like, a, a fuck-off button. Uh, this way? Wait, where am I? Oh, I'm back at the- I'm back at the map or where am I? Yes, I am. Still- God, you can roll in this game. I don't know how else I would get around. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I'm not gonna run around for bones at this point. Where's the 96 in every level? I don't know if bone collection <laughs> actually matters in this game. I don't... Did I get a sticker for collecting all the bones on the first level? I don't remember. Oh, hi, okay. Puppy. My name is Yvonne. Gesundheit. Thanks. I think I've got a bit of a head cold. You need hey, to Yvonne, cover your sneeze. To 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 We're in a pandemic. Can you give me any advice? Oh, sure. I know this place like the back of my wing. As you make your way up, I'll drop in every now and then with some advice. Thanks a lot for your help, Yvonne. Whoa. Just took right off. Okay, so... I hate this level. <laughs> this is the first level that's actually, like, any degree of challenging because it involves a lot of vertical platforming. And the platforming in this game is awful. <laughs> Uh, because the controls, like the when you jump, like it's very like slippery and imprecise. You'll see. I'm probably gonna end up abusing save states because I. Uh. <laughs> yeah, we got Yvonne the rat. The rat? Wow, the bat. There is a rat actually. A couple levels from there, we'll see him. Oh, do I need that? No. But I don't, hopefully won't be coming back to this area, so I might as well just eat it. I always thought that the food in this game looked really good. I know it's like very low res, like GIF. I think it looks tasty. <sighs> okay. Oh my god. I think I'm gonna make a save stay. <laughs> When I climb back up here. That save. Okay, I think it's I think we're good. Mm. 
No, no! Okay. Uh, wait. No, no, no. <laughs> Fuck that. Just make a safe state up here, though. Listen, I'm such a veteran of this game. I deserve to be able to cheat. Um, okay. Set one here. I, should, I think the problem is when I'm jumping up here and I'm just like panicking. There we go. No problem. Sticker! Wow! But yeah, I deserve a sticker for that nightmare, but it's only gonna get worse. All the puppies are at least a little fucked up. Oh my god. The sound... The sound that those choppers make is so horrible. Just the loud sawing. Okay. Puppy up there. Okay, I'm definitely gonna save stick up here, because climbing these stairs is annoying. Oh, what do you want, Yvonne? Ride the swinging clock pendulums across the room to make it to the exit. And make sure to explore the hidden rooms on the side. You don't have to tell me to explore hidden rooms. Okay, we're saving again. Oh. Wow, it's really bright out here. <laughs> That's so sad. How long were you in there? Definitely not gonna try to get all the bones at this level. <laughs> oh wait, this is Oddball's level. I keep forgetting. I also like Oddball and Domino like have all the exact same dialogue. So you don't even get like any like flavor changes from being either character. Purely cosmetic. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen Thumbelina. Are you talking about Yvonne? Okay, this hasn't been so bad so far. Knock on wood. Another save state though, because it's always when I'm actually trying to traverse the room that I start falling off. Ooh. Okay, that was very smooth and <laughs> unproblematic. As a kid, I didn't know this this parrot's name, and, and now that I think of it, is it Waddlesworth? So anyway, I used to just call him Checkpoint because that's all he was to me. I could have very easily found out his name if I just watched the cutscenes, but... <laughs> no. Oh my god, die! What do you think? It takes so many barks. That's another one I'll have to watch. I didn't think the Swan Princess was that bad. It wasn't good, really, but it was okay.
Okay, now this part. Ugh. Okay. Ride the piston up to the top of the room. Try jumping when you get <laughs> close to the top. <laughs> That's a great review. It does not sound fun, Audible. You were out of your mind. Put two sticks here because they they know how fucked up this level is. Can I jump to that from here? Whoa! Sure feels good to be out of there. Did I just see a blimp? I can't look up. There we go. Oops. This is exactly what Big Ben looks like on the inside. Crates of puppies included. This side. I'm shocked that that didn't hurt me. the first time. Okay, now this room is the room where I fall down 100 times. Bitch. Okay. I'm allowed to say that because I'm playing a female dog. <laughs> Oddball's reclaiming the slur. Mm. How did you know I needed a stake? Because those choppers of the devil? Okay. I'm gonna save state right here. Domino can break open the crate just by headbutting them from the outside. Would it not stand to reason that the puppies inside could break it from in there? Or are their heads not as strong as ours? We are the Don't superior siblings. To wait when it reaches the bottom of its cycle. Look around the room as you're traveling up and down, and you might find some cool stuff. Cool stuff. Okay, I'm definitely going to stay here. She just wanted to go stand on another pillar. Oh my god, this is already too much. Hello?
Here's your spear. Now jump to the yellow counterweight. From there, you might be able to rescue one of your brothers. You can also jump on the green counterweight if you want to head toward the exit. <laughs> no, I think I'll just stay here forever. Also, the way she said, like, if you want to rescue one of your brothers was very sinister. Like, like, like I was saying, like, the fact that <laughs> these animals know where all my captured siblings are, but aren't, like, actually helping very much. It's really kind of Great. awful. Now, make sure you explore the ledges that you can reach from this counterweight. But you don't need a running start to Come break the boxes. I'll show you. Look, I can stand right here. <laughs> I get my paws on so well, I'm gonna... Okay. Oh my god, do you have to talk to me on every single one of these you want? Now Whoa. jump off onto that ledge, and you'll find a way to get to the purple counterweight. I, I could have figured there, it out. You'll find a way to the exit, which will take you closer to the top of Big Bang. Yeah, no, I figured. God, I don't know why all of a sudden this thing needs to hold my hand. Okay. Oh, I'll show you that Oh. Well, I don't want to load my save stick because I want to do all that shit again. Ugh. Damn it. This is what I'm talking about. <laughs> Speed run. I actually did watch a speedrun of this game. It's very broken. Whoa. Alright. Let's save a state here. Oh, shit. You can probably hear me frantically mashing to kill those guys. Oh my god. Okay, done. With the horrible part. Well, one of the horrible parts. I think this is the last room. Oh my god, I... Will I ever kill one of those things without sustaining damage? Oh, the bones are here. <laughs> so hard to follow your nose. Why? Why? Why are you leading me that way and then this way? Oh my god, fuck this. Okay. The worst. It's too high, I can't possibly reach that. I can't jump off of this apparently. Ugh, I'm sweating. Um, no. <laughs> you missed me getting out of the. Oh god, she's running up to me. The, uh, the counterweight room. Finally made it past the pillars. Use the spinning gears to cross the gaps. You've almost made it to the top of Big Ben. Thanks. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm safe sitting here. <laughs> this camera. Not helpful. It's 
a good thing Tibbs taught me how to use an elevator. Never would have figured that one out. <gasps> oh my god, I almost fell off! I almost died for you. Sticker! Okay. We're in the home stretch. Well? Oh no, that's the wrong one. Nope, that's also the wrong one. Did I not save it? There we go. Oops. Should frame that off for a second. Frantically trying to find the correct save state. Oh my god, I was thinking about re-listening re to Counterweight. I still haven't started Partisan, so... <laughs> Seems like as good a time as any. Alright, well I have 95 bones. Good enough for me. I got all the puppies and that's all that matters. I mean, you don't even have to go that far. You, you could finish this game with zero puppies, and they would still be like, congrats, you did it! Oh, okay, there's our first boss. I'm at Big Ben and ready to deal with the Mongols. You will be invincible, my sweet! The country's armed with my new tomato cannon! I'm going in! We're not going to be able to contact the barking chain with Corella hanging around. We'll have to get rid of her somehow. <laughs> hmm, maybe those rusty old catapults will still work. Why? Okay. Are, are there catapults on top of Big Ben? Second of all, <laughs> why is there pineapples on them? I'll just have to take care of this as quickly as possible. No, I I stunned you. Where'd you go? Oh. So I think in all the Corilla fights in this game you have to like throw fruit at her. I don't know why <laughs> that's the chosen method, but okay, I don't think stunning her is even worth uh -oh. the time. I think Corilla's changing her tactics. Changing tactics. Yeah, it is Anana. Spoilers. More traffic in London than the Piccadilly level would have you believe. Alright. <laughs> care of that old Cruella. We can contact the barking chain. Oh, yeah. Or like a fourth of the way through this game. Or that tracks because I think there's twenty levels. Not twenty. Well, twenty including the bosses? Or 18? Oh. I don't know. I don't know how to do math. Uh, that's not loud enough to reach the barking chain, Domino. Try again. Okay. Oh. Uh, rough. Uh, louder, Domino. Oh. Uh, rough. Uh, hey, a volume control. <laughs> Chain started. Now all we have to do is wait for an answer. Uh, how could those vile puppies defeat me, Cruella Deville? I don't really get this barking chain thing. It must be your fault. But but ma, we tried to get him, but they silence. Just go get those puppies now. <laughs> Pause, boom. Is the super gloop ready? <laughs> Almost, my darling. Just a few bugs to work out, and then... And then the fun begins. <laughs> I 
I can't quite make it out. It's hard to hear. He says, go. And me. There's no possible way that any dog's bark would carry all the way to the top of Big Ben. <laughs> Royal Museum. The museum? That's just a few blocks away. Let's go. So they have to run all the way back down. I'm glad that I don't have to play that part. Okay. I think I'm gonna um, stop playing the story here because this game is broken up into like nice little chunks. You do four levels and then you play a boss, and so there's four. Oh my god, I'm gonna leave me alone. There are four five level chunks, I guess. So we're only really a fourth of the way through, and maybe I'll pick this up again. Some other time is there? That was up there. But I think what I might do right now is go check out my stickers. I just saved, I'll do it again. Um, and maybe play a mini game. I wonder if I've un unlocked any of them so far. Uh, here's my stickers. Ooh, I hate that sound. Can I okay, I have to watch them load in one by one. There's nothing I can do. Oh, I missed one in the toy store. Probably from getting all the bones. Yeah, I think you do get a sticker for getting all the bones. Well, listen, this isn't a 100% run. <laughs> Cool. Yeah, okay, so you can see. Well, spoilers, but there's 16. Oh, 16 levels and then five Cruella fights. I don't know what that extras is. How do I get out of here? I just have to exit. Okay. I guess there's no real point to the sticker. <laughs> there's no real point to the stickers besides measuring your progress. Oh, I unlocked the tilt maze. Oh god. I was playing the mini golf the other day. Um, it's kind of awful. Oh, just me playing this by myself. Uh. Very good. Off to a good start. Oh, but the like camera in this is not your friend. Oh. I'm already over par, this is awful. Great. The joke. Oh god. Oh, do you mean you like the di the joke of Dig Dog? <laughs> oh, that was impressive. Is that a birdie? I don't know what golf terms. Yeah, this sucks. <laughs> Oh, this is a preview of the levels to come, because these are all based on levels in the game. Maybe I should have saved this for after I did all the levels, but... Oh, god. Ugh. Where... Where's the... okay, it's not, this is not a good vantage point. Okay, that's what you meant. What? Oh, I want the... 
Oh, this is not gonna be a good one. Is there lightning out there? What was that? Oh, it's just like a... What is that? What is that in the distance? Okay. This weird floating mini golf course. I... I don't... I've played mini golf a couple of times in real life. And I'm, I'm not really sure that I prefer it to <laughs> virtual mini golf. It's because it's certainly much more stren. Well, I don't want to say strenuous, but it involves a lot of walking back and forth. Damn it. Wait, this, at least in like real mini golf, I can fucking see what I'm doing. <laughs> this is awful. Are you kidding me? Come on over par. Oh no, okay, this level I could not figure out last time, but I... I understand it now. Well... The camera is like inverted, and sometimes the... like rotation of the aim is too, this is not control well, is what I'm saying. Oh, thank god. I had a time with that before. Oh, nice. This is going better than before. Oh, there's just like... Oh, I think I'm, when I was on that other golf course, I must have been seeing this one in the background. They're just all loaded at once. Well, like, actually, I guess they must be, because otherwise they would have to load between holes. Ooh. Cool. <laughs> Very good. Oh my god, I just want to get out of this spot. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Wait, did I beat it? That was it? Wait, what, what was my score? <laughs> I'm gonna have to look at the stream to see what my score was. <laughs> Maybe there isn't a, a hole based on every level. Oh my god, I looked at the script stream and I missed it again. Uh, well... I used to- there's a checkers mini game in this, in this game and I used to just play the checkers for like ever. <laughs> oh, the ice race is fun too. Ugh, I hate the tilt maze though. I'll do Dig Dog because that one's quick, and then I think that'll be it for the stream. Do I dig? <laughs> There's a button that says it at the bottom. Oh, okay. Crazy! Crazy! Dig! Oh, oh. Wait. Is that this one? Yeah. This is really showing how poor my short term memory is. This 
Oh, I was, uh, was me? Yes. Okay. I shouldn't underestimate myself. your commentary every time. Oh, ball. Uh, I know I've seen this before, but I don't know where it is. Nope. What? Oh. Wait. Is it here? Yes. There's only one match left, I should automatically win. That's the match. Yay! Oh, I did better than I did last time. Always improving. Okay. Well, I'm getting very sweaty, <laughs> so I think that's a good time to call it. Um, yeah, so there's all this left. So we're gonna come back to this another time. Um, yeah, okay, well, <laughs> thank you, Jazz, for coming up to coming up for showing up to support me in my in my first stream. I hope that it was okay. I did my best. <laughs> um yeah, so and if anybody's watching this later, thanks for watching this later. <laughs> oh good, I'm glad. Alright, well, have a good night, and uh, stay safe and healthy, wash your hands, and uh, if anybody's watching this who has not yet voted in their primary election uh, for their state, vote for Bernie Sanders. Alright, that's it. See ya.